Hi everybody, Andy here with eTrailer.com and today we're going to take a look at this Trailer Valet JXS Side Mount Side Wine Trailer Jack. Now this trailer jack is going to let you raise and lower your boat or recreational trailer and this has a lift capacity of 3,000 pounds with a support capacity of 5,000 pounds. Now this jack features a manual crank, as you can see, but it also includes a drill a power option that is compatible with 18 volt to 24 volt drills using this included drill attachment. So this is going to greatly speed up um, extending and retracting your jack over this manual crank handle. Uh, by the way, this handle is about six and a half inches long overall. And the overall height from the top of our jack to the ground that it's uh, sitting on uh, in the, re the retracted position that we have it in right now is sitting right at about 23 inches. And then the overall height when this is fully extended, again, from the top of our jack to the ground that it's sitting on, is going to be about 37 inches extended. Now looking at our bracket and measuring from our bracket the retracted height from the center of our bracket to the ground that it's going to be sitting on is about 11 and a half inches and then when this jack is fully extended measuring again from the center of our bracket to the ground that it's sitting on is going to be about 25 and a half inches. So you're going, you're going to have a travel of about 14 inches overall. Now the patented gear material composition offers maximum efficiency while reducing heat retention and the built-in sleeve fitting provides protection and a smooth glide. And just uh, moving this up and down here briefly, it is a very smooth operation. This does have a gear ratio of three to four and the tubular swivel design is going to let you twist this jack up for storage and then down for use when you remove the included pin and clip here. Now taking a look at our bracket here, I do have this kind of loosely connected just so you can get an idea of what this is going to look like. The maximum uh, frame size fit is going to be right at about four and three quarters inches tall and then the maximum depth is going to be about three and three quarters inches deep. The bolt holes are going to be separated on center about five and a half inches horizontally and our vertical mounting holes are going to be separated on center by one inch each for a total of five inches from the top hole to the bottom hole on center. Now the installation does require uh, eight inches of clearance and the uh, clearance from the mounting bracket to the top of our jack is about 14 inches. Now this does include a foot plate which is going to be, which is going to prevent this jack from sinking on soft ground. And our foot plate measures seven and three quarters inches long by about four and a quarter inches wide. Our outer tube diameter is two and a quarter inches and our inner tube diameter is two inches. And this uh, jack to me feels like it's very uh, heavy duty, very high quality. And it features a wrinkle black powder coat that's going to offer great weather resistance and this is a, a great finish. It feels like it's applied um, it, it pretty, pretty thick. And so I don't think you're going to have to worry about it chipping or peeling away easily at all. And not only is it going to prevent, uh, protect your jack from the elements, but it actually looks really good on this jack as well. So um, that finish is uh, going to offer quite a bit of protection for you. This does include instructions. And uh, if this meets the specs that you are looking for, I think this is going to be a great jack for you to consider. Well, that's going to conclude our look today. I do hope that it was helpful for you. Again, my name is Andy. Thank you for joining me.